My name is Annelies Dole. I'm the mother of three grown-up children and in a happily relationship. I live in the Netherlands, near a small town near Amsterdam. And as a profession, I am a company lawyer for a Dutch airline. My journey to be diagnosed with LPA has been a rather long story. When I was um, 49, I, was, I, I got a heart attack out of the blue. Uh, uh, afterwards, there were some signs, but since I was healthy uh, all the time, I didn't recognize the sign. So when I got a heart attack, I was tested uh, for all kinds of things, the standard factors uh, for a heart disease. But everything seems to be okay, except there were, that there was a lot of articulosis uh, in my uh, arteries. So that was uh, rather particular because I was that young. So uh, I was sent home with a lot of medication, uh, but the problems came back after a few months and then again and then again. So um, in three years time, I got five uh, stents placed in my uh, veins in the heart. And since I had some problems with the medication of the um, cholesterol, I was sent to uh, uh, another physician, um, a specialist in um, uh, arteries, and he uh, tested my um, LPA level. And then it showed that uh, it was much too high, but it was after three years uh, after the first heart attack. Well, I, I never heard about uh, LPA before because my uh, cardio cardiologist never told me about uh, LPA. And after uh, when I talked with her after it, she never heard of it also. So uh, it was, uh, well, quite a shock. And of course, I did a lot of research uh, after that because I wanted to know what it was and what it did with, uh, with the heart. And I got a very clear explanation from that um, uh, doctor as well. It, it was a kind of relief to know that uh, finally you know what was causing all the troubles for all that years before. Uh, but it was also uh, a shock because um, there's no medication now for it. So uh, the conclusion is that you have to live with it and that's, uh, that is something that you have to uh, work out for yourself. After the diagnosis, my outlook of life changed a lot because especially in the first uh, three years after the heart attack, uh, there were a lot of uh, infections in my veins. Um, so I had to go to the hospital every uh, couple of months um, to get a stent. So I really thought that uh, well, my, my life would end well, maybe early in my 60s or so. It made me depressed. Luckily now, um, I am more, uh, much more balanced and uh, the, the last three years, so I'm much uh, <laughs> uh, convinced that I will uh, grow a little bit older than uh, what I saw before, but yeah, it changed a lot of uh, what it does to the future. My advice to people that are just diagnosed uh, with a heart disease, with a LPA, high, high LPA levels is that um, try to accept it. For me, the, the way to acceptance has been, has been really a struggle and I needed professional help. Well, I think acceptance is, is most important. It's really a struggle, but try to get there because you can't change it. It's there and you can't change it. And uh, if you struggle every day with it, uh, it costs a lot of energy. And it, that took me a couple of years to find out. <laughs> so my advice, and I hope for everyone else, is that they can do it a bit quicker than I did. I have one final message uh, to share with all heart patients that are diagnosed with article sclerosis and don't have uh, any uh, knowledge of why they are uh, having this. Uh, because they, their cholesterol is okay, their, their blood pressure is okay. And, uh, they are too young to have this disease uh, already. Uh, I know there are a lot of people struggling with this and have no clue what is causing it. So I would, my advice would be to uh, let your LPA uh, level check because it really gives you peace of mind when you know what the cause is of all your problems because otherwise you keep searching, you are, keep blaming yourself, what did I do wrong? It gives you really peace of mind. So my advice to everyone who is struggling with this disease is let uh, inform your 
um, cardiologist and let your LPA level being checked.